Hey guys, Joe here for Gamer Toys, and I'm back with another pickup video. And today I got a nice variety of things from Ninja Turtles to some uh, vintage Disney stuff and uh, some Waterworld. So let's dive right in. All right, let's start in with some Disney stuff. Um, I picked these two guys up off Instagram. There's a seller on Instagram that I follow, and he had these pretty cheap, so I grabbed them. I believe this guy is from Darkwing Duck. Uh, he could be the villain. I'm not 100% sure. It's been a long time since I've seen that show, but um, I just thought it was a cool figure. I'm not even sure. He has a switch back here for some sort of action feature, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't work. It's just a cool display piece, and uh, he has this megaphone. Hopefully, um, I can find a Darkwing Duck at a toy show or something and uh, pair them together. Next up, so this guy I am slightly more familiar with, and I know he is a villain from Tailspin. I love the sculpt of this guy. Uh, very limited articulation. He's got, you know, neck, arms, and legs, so he's got five points. I guess six if you want to count his tail. Um, pretty clean overall. Um, I got this guy from the same seller on Instagram. He comes with his... Uh, Whip. Oh, he has wrist movement. See, look at that. I'm I'm selling this guy short. He's he's pretty sweet. Yeah. So it's like a whip with a sword handle. I don't know. Pretty cool. He came with a little treasure chest, but the lid broke off. Maybe I can get a replacement down the road. But overall, pretty cool figure. Now, by the time you guys see this, you probably have already seen me pick this guy up. I picked him up at Big Ben's Comics. Me and Jay went there and shot. A retro toy hunt episode there and I saw this guy there 695 I got him for five bucks which isn't too bad this is one of the remaining if I'm looking over there yeah I believe I only need one more figure and that's one of the other variations of Kevin Costner but yeah I need a Deacon the main bad guy cool figure the sculpting on this figure is great I love the eye patch the accessories are wild though like it looks like he wears this over him and it shoots discs, which is kind of cool. And he comes with a mutant fish. I love these figures. This is such a guilty pleasure for me. Such a crazy and weird line and I just love it. Love this Kenner stuff. So yeah, Deacon, one of the last ones I needed. Glad to add him to my collection for five bucks. I got myself a wing nut. Now this wing nut is so clean and so minty comes with all of his accessories um, including God don't hate me guys but I can't remember this guy's name um, I keep wanting to say Joe eyeball but that's the guy that came with Muckman. I can't remember this guy's name but he came with wingnut as well it's just a great figure um, the belt is in great shape he's definitely gonna be replacing my beat up wingnut that I actually still have from my childhood I'm not gonna get rid of it I'm just gonna pack it away and this guy will go on the shelf to be probably displayed and all of his minty glory. Great figure. And last but not least, also another vintage TMNT figure, I got Genghis Frog. And this guy is also super minty. And he came with his little sunglasses. Uh, this is a piece you always lose. This was like the first thing I lost as a child when I got my Genghis Frog originally. So this guy's great. Uh, he comes with his little like tongue gun. I don't know, it's kinda it's kinda risque nowadays. He has all four of his grenades, which is a must, and his shield. This guy was always being played with in the bathtub when I was a kid. And uh, I'm just glad to add him back to my collection because this is one of the few that I was missing. I love the vintage Ninja Turtles line so much. And every time I get a new one to add to the collection, I'm just hit with the wave of nostalgia. I love it, can't get enough. So that's it guys, I wanna thank you for watching another pickups video. And I hope you guys enjoyed some of the stuff I got. Probably not the water world. I'm just weird like that. But like I said, thank you. Stay tuned for more episodes and I'll catch you in the next video.